Hi, I'm Jay Tomlin, a product manager with ShareFile Enterprise. As you know, ShareFile is a secure online service that lets you store, sync, and share files, whether those files are in the cloud or on your premises. One of the issues, of course, with software as a service is that you don't want your users to have to remember yet another username and password for logging on. So a feature of ShareFile Enterprise is that we can integrate with your existing enterprise credentials for single sign-on. Let's take a look at how that works. Inside your network, you've got Active Directory configured with all of your users and group information. And this is the credentials that you want users to use whenever they sign on. ShareFile provides a tool called the User Management Tool, or UMT. The UMT connects to Active Directory and synchronizes user and group information. So it can know which of your users and groups you want to be enabled for ShareFile, and then automatically provision and deprovision those groups into the ShareFile cloud. Now, of course, we're not sending passwords up into the cloud, only first name, last name, email address, so that ShareFile knows which users to expect. When a user signs on, though, we want them to log on with their Active Directory password. So how does that work? Well, when a user runs ShareFile on their mobile device, ShareFile will redirect that user to go and log on to a SAML identity provider that you configure in your DMZ. This SAML identity provider can be something like Microsoft ADFS, Ping Identity, or CA SiteMinder, really anything that supports SAML. And when the user logs in, they'll be logging on with their Active Directory username and password. Once that's successful, the SAML IDP will provide an assertion that's digitally signed, and that's presented back up to ShareFile so that ShareFile knows the user successfully authenticated. So that's how we tie into the Active Directory password but you don't want your users to have to log on with their password every single time they run the app on a mobile device. So after the authentication is successful, ShareFile will place an OAuth token on the user's device. And you can think of this token like a persistent cookie that lives for a configurable number of days. It can be seven days, 30 days, however frequently you want the users to re-enter their password is the lifespan of that token. And then, whenever a user leaves the organization, the user management tool will also take care of deprovisioning the user account out of ShareFile, and ShareFile will revoke any of the access tokens that have been issued to that user's devices. So that's how ShareFile integrates with your enterprise Active Directory systems for user authentication and single sign-on.